Rains are wreaking havoc in Uttarakhand. At least 60 people are believed to have died in Kedarnath in Uttarakhand. Several people are still trapped there following flooding that has been reported after incessant rainfall. Rescue operation is currently on in full swing. Latest reports coming in suggest that there's been a cloud burst as well in Bhanolti in Uttarakhand where 400 people are believed to be stranded. The Chardham Yatra to the four holy shrines of Badrinath, Kedarnath, Gangotri and Yamunotri has come to a grinding halt. Nearly 25,000 tourists and pilgrims on their way to the pilgrimage have now been stranded. Landslides have been reported from over 12 places in the hill state. Six hanging bridges built on Alaknanda and Mandakini rivers have also been reportedly damaged. The Uttarakhand government has sounded an alert following flash floods in many parts of the state. Right, we are joined now by Anupam Duvedi. He's the District Administration Officer, Uttar Kashi. Mr. Duvedi, thank you very much for joining us. Uh, first up, sir, uh, just bring us the details that are coming in of flash floods and also uh, what has happened in Rudra district where we believe 60 people have died in Kedarnath. Uh, no, I, I don't uh, confirm this news because District Administration has not found any information just one hour ago, we have talked our SDM. He, he is in Kedarnath. Uh, CEO Rudhubayag is in Kedarnath. Uh, this news was found by your uh, channel uh, that uh, Gandhi Sarovar has uh, flood out, but uh, the administration has no such type of information. Few people are missing, but that was on yesterday night. Nothing happened today. जो हमारी बहत्तर घंटे से अनवरत बारिश चल रही है, इसके चलते हमारे संपर्क मार्ग कट गए हैं, यात्री विभिन्न स्थानों पर सुरक्षित रखे जा रहे हैं, जो केदारनाथ में हैं, उनको मंदिर में शरण लिए हुए हैं, उपजिलाधिकारी उखी में सुबह स्वयं इस चीज को बताए हैं कि वो सुरक्षित हैं और यात्री भी सुरक्� इसी प्रकार गौरीकुंड में फंसे हुए यात्रियों को थोड़ा ऊंचाई वाले स्थान त्रिभुवन नारायण की ओर शिफ्ट किया गया है और गुप्तकाशी तथा रुद्रप्रयाग में बनाए गए रिलीफ सेंटर्स में विभिन्न तीर्थ यात्रियों को रखा गया है जिनकी तादाद 1200 से 1500 के बीच है जी दिवेदी साहब आप हमें एक बार दोबारा से क्लैरिफाई कीजिए जो रिपोर्ट्स आ रही हैं इस समय केदारनाथ से कि 60 लोगों के करीब लोगों की मौत हो गई है वहां पर लैंडस्लाइड्स के चलते क्या अभी तक एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन के बार के पास इसकी कोई जानकारी नहीं है जी जी मैडम बिल्कुल जानकारी नहीं है चूंकि संचार के सारे साधन कटे हुए हैं कभी कभार बीच में एक मोबाइल का नेटवर्क पकड़ता है उसके माध्यम से सुबह लगभग सात बजे के आसपास उप जिलाधिकारी उठीमठ ने स्वयं जिलाधिकारी जी से बात किया उन्होंने यह इंश्योर किया कि सभी यात्री सुरक्षित हैं और मंदिर में शरण लिए हुए हैं और मिस्टर द्विवेदी थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर जॉइनिंग अस वी आल्सो हैव डीएम उत्तर काशी डॉक्टर राजेश कुमार नाउ जॉइनिंग अस मिस्टर कुमार व्हाट मोर डिटेल्स कैन यू शेयर विद अस वी बिलीव रेस्क्यू एफर्ट्स आर ऑन एट फुल स्विंग एंड उत्तर काशी वी हैव सीन अ लॉट ऑफ रिपोर्ट्स कमिंग इन ऑफ लैंडस्लाइड्स um uh, the rescue efforts are in full swing and uh, our first priority is to uh, get the yatris to safe havens and we have done so we have succeeded in doing so and uh, around five, there are 5000 standard yatris and uh, we have provided food and uh, shelter to them and we we'll continue to do so till the end Right, Dr. Kumar, are there also reports of some of the tourists being stranded in some parts of Uttar Kashi considering there is a Char Dham Yatra that takes place uh, at this time uh, and we know that some of these routes now have been blocked because of massive landslides in some parts. We have opened around 15 camps uh, throughout the district, around 15 to 20 camps and uh, we are facing uh, these Yatris in these camps and um, uh, there are a few Yatris who uh, got stuck up uh, um, in certain places where there's nowhere else to go. So for the Yatris, what we're doing is we're um, providing food, we're taking them to the hotels and we're feeding them in the hotels and then simply bringing them, them back uh, to their respective places. So Yatris are in negligible numbers. Most of the Yatris um, are in uh, the uh, camps which were open for them.
Right, and Dr. Kumar, are people also being evacuated from some parts where uh, uh, there are, you know, there are predictions that there could be incessant rainfall that could, could lead to landslides? Uh, we started the process of evacuation yesterday and we uh, succeeded in evacuating around 3,000 uh, yatris. Uh, but the um, effort got hampered because the, uh, the routes of the evacuation, they got, uh, uh, they got blocked and uh, our engineers are uh, working day and night to uh, remove those roadblocks. So once those roadblocks get cleared, we'll start the process of evacuation once again.